Hi, everyone. Welcome to the Midnight Society. My name is Sunday Omni. It's been a while. I haven't seen you guys for so long. Welcome. Welcome, 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 you guys. Some interesting information has been confirmed. Let's talk about it. If you're new to my channel, welcome. Great to see you. Um, to my new subscribers from TikTok, welcome. I'm happy to have you guys here as well. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. This is the Midnight Society, everyone. So in this video, we have to talk about it. Ashanti has confirmed, and Nellie, that she is expecting a child at 43 years old with the rapper. I must say, when I saw this news, we were talking about Ashanti, I believe, last month on the channel, and I told you guys that I really like this woman. She's been a good girl for so long and just focused on her career, her music. She has no problems with anybody. And I'm just wondering, why did this man come back into her life after 20 years just to make her a baby mama? Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Ladies, let me know if you're watching. What are your thoughts about this? Nellie and Ashanti. She's 43 years old. I've seen some ladies in her comments, and I've seen some women are just like, what is going on here? What is going on here? Why is Nellie, why did he come back to her life? not to even honor her, like, just to make her baby mama. Like, this is just crazy in itself. I mean, some of you are going to say, well, you know, it doesn't matter. Um, it doesn't matter. I just like them together. But why did he come back into her life after 20 years? I just want to understand that. 20 years. Yeah, Angela, great to see you. Angela's wondering the same thing. Why didn't he marry her? Why is he having a child with her? She's 43 years old, you guys. At her big age, choosing this at her age. This guy is not even committing to anything. Um... Oh my goodness. Anyway, I, I really didn't want to make this video because I know some of you guys are going to be like, oh my God, you're being a hater. This is not about being a hater. It's like Ashanti is such a lovely young woman. So lovely. Okay. For the 20 years that this guy broke her heart, let's not forget, he broke her heart. She's always been in love with him. Okay. Always been in love with him. Um, always been in love with him and she wasn't rumored to be with so many guys as well in the industry. Okay. You never hear about her getting involved with so many guys and all this kind of stuff. No, nope. she was just focused on her music career and family and just keeping her relationships private. Because whenever she's made her relationships public as well, she's had some issues with that. But in general, she's just a good girl. That's always loved this guy. This was the announcement. I'm just like, anyway, I didn't want to do this video. Because I know that some of you are going to be like, Sunny, like, oh my goodness, I really didn't want to do this video. <laughs> You know why I came to do this video, you guys? Because on my TikTok, ladies, you have to check out my TikTok. Go and follow me on TikTok. I am connecting singles, okay? I am doing a TikTok and chill, okay? You can call it OK TikTok, plenty of TikTok, whatever you want to call it. Um, my TikTok has been doing really well, but they, I'm having some reporting my TikTok. They are claiming I am not real. Okay, so I need you guys to go and support me on my TikTok. Okay, I'm there. If you're single, let's connect you. Okay, 
So I'm starting with Canada, singles in Canada, and I plan to do international as well. Okay, so you have to check it out when I'm live, but I do have haters, okay, who are reporting me and TikTok continues to restrict me. That's the reason why I came back over here just to talk with you guys and encourage you guys to come over, okay? So follow me at Sunday Omni on TikTok. So back to Ashanti and Nelly. Your ex-boyfriend that broke your heart 20 years ago comes back into your life just to make you a baby mama. Hmm. It's, I, I just, you guys, I just, you know, I don't want to really say even what I want to say. I really don't want to say it, okay? Because it's just going to come across like I was... I wasn't that happy when I saw this video, okay? Angela says, congratulations, Ashanti and Nelly. I thought this was an engagement video. When I first saw this excitement and all this kind of stuff, I thought it was some sort of engagement. And yeah, it's just at 43 years old, you know, 43 years old, you wait, and your ex from 20 years ago comes back into your life, doesn't even honor you. No. This is a no for me, okay? I feel like Ashanti deserves better. That's why. I think she deserves better than this. She should be treated better than this. Um, because she's she's a nice woman and everything. So it's just too bad to see Nelly um, treat her like this. He was able to marry the other woman he was with. So it's not like, um, or he was engaged for the other woman. Hold on a second. Let's just confirm this. Was Nelly married? Wasn't he married or engaged to another lady? Let's Let me confirm this. There was another woman he has children with. Um, mm. Okay, so he was never married then, or he was? I think he... You guys, was he married to the last lady he was with? Is rapper Nelly married does he have kids or a wife he was taken in 2020 he's been dating Chantel Jackson since 2014 he has two adult children a son and a daughter yeah there's a woman I've seen him with let me see here Chantel Jackson, longtime girlfriend. See, this is the thing. What? Okay, thank you so much. Angela, thanks. Thanks for that. Appreciate it. You guys like the video. Um, like the video. Um, this is not the kind of video you're probably expecting. Maybe you guys are expecting me to be excited about it, but sadly, I just feel like Ashanti deserves better than this at 43 years old with her having so many options of guys that she can choose from. So many options. It's so clear that she is more into this guy than he is into her. And another thing as well, you guys, Ashanti has her own money. She's very successful. So what would he have to worry about even being with her? It's not like she, it's not like she wants him for his money. You know how some of these guys are so worried um, that, oh, these girls are going to take their money. But this Ashanti has millions. She also does lots of international shows. She's constantly invited to Dubai as well. And she has shows where she gets paid millions. So um, the point I'm trying to make is if he's worried about money and his assets, he shouldn't be worried because she has her own. But I really feel like Ashanti deserves better than this. I, I really do. Um, if I can, if I continue to talk in this video, you, some of you guys are going to be so disappointed. So um, maybe I'll just keep it short. Okay. Um, 
43 years old, waited 20 years. This guy comes back into her life just to make her baby mama. I thought it was like an engagement video or something like this. I just couldn't believe it. I was like, wow, 43 years old. And this is what she is tolerating. Do you guys think this relationship is going to work out long term? If the guy's already treating her like this, do you think this relationship is going to work out long term? Ladies, let me know. What do you think? Do you think this relationship is going to work out long term? For me personally, if um, this guy does not see her value or how special she is and all this kind of stuff, like, nope. Um, no. Okay. I give it 10 years, 10 years max, 10 years max, 10 years. That's like a lot. That's max. Okay. I give it a decade. I give this relationship a decade, 10 years. I agree. Angela, I agree. I agree. Like, why are you willing to make big decisions and have a woman have your child and everything, but you can't even commit to that woman? What kind of selfishness is this? And just, this is just all about him. It's all about him. Ashanti did an interview with People Magazine, and she said that she's ready to get married and have a family and all that kind of stuff. So what's his problem? What is going on here? Is he just worried about his money? Like, is it all about his money and his assets? She has her own. She doesn't need his money or anything like that. So what's the issue? I don't even get it. I just don't get it. She just deserves better, you guys, sincerely. Um, so yeah, I am disappointed. Okay. I'm not, I'm not happy about this. Um, Gloria, Gloria Valentine. Great to see you. Gloria says she does deserve better, but you've got what you want. You've, you've got, you've got to want it. Low self-esteem and you'll settle for any crumbs you get. You can get absolutely. You guys, now that Ashanti is 43 years old, she is just kind of like, well, let me go for Nelly. Even though she has all these options, she has all these options. Great singer, very respected. She's just, you know, Ashanti, I think, is stuck on who she used to be, her youth. Nelly reminds her of her young days. You know what I mean? When she sees Nelly, he reminds her of all just the major things that happened in her life, all these positive memories as well that he witnessed in her career and her growth. And that's why he's so special to her. But for this guy, she's not that special to him, you guys. She's not that special to him. I don't think he really values her the way she values him. You know, when I start looking at the body language and everything, I mean, it just looks to me like she is more into this than he is. So why is he wasting her time? What is this all about? What is the meaning of this? Wow. I mean, wow, I'm, I just, ladies, I, I know if, if I keep talking, some of you are going to be like, oh my gosh, like this is so negative, like, you know, <laughs> so I just, oh my gosh. I give it 10 years. You guys, I've been right about a lot of these celebrity relationships, 10 years. Okay, 10 years, and we're going to hear that they split up, okay? 10 years. I give it 10 years. A decade, that's really good. That's longer than lots of people's relationships in Hollywood, okay? 10 years. 
we're going to hear this relationship is over. Um, he's going to disappoint her and break her heart again. It's very clear to me that this man was not a good choice. And for Ashanti, just going forward like this, I mean, uh, you have to let a man know what your goals are and what you expect. Like, sincerely, you have to let them know. Well, it's so obvious because some people will just waste your time and just try to, like, put you in a situation. And it's like, no. Like, no, like, you have to know what you want in life. Like, these people are too old to be even playing these kind of games. Like, 43 years old? Like, this is not a time to be let, allowing someone to waste your time and mislead you. Look at Ashanti here. So happy. So happy to be with Nelly. Look at his body language. Look at the body language. It says it all. It says it all. Okay. She's like, cheese, so happy and everything. The guy just looks off. Okay. So he's had his chances to make all these mistakes and all that kind of stuff. All these broken relationships he's had and everything like that. Broken fatherless home that he created as well. And you know, his relationship with his live-in girlfriend also didn't work and all this. And Ashanti was just busy, focused on her music all these years. She didn't have any children. She's never been married. Okay. She was just focused on her music. And now this guy's like, well, you know what? Um, she's 43 years old. Let me go and see what I can do. I think it's time for me to make her a baby mama. Yep, it's time. It's time for me to do that. Not going to marry her. None of that. Not going to commit to her. Just going to make her baby mama. And that's it. And that's exactly what he did. And when I saw the video of them, and I was like, oh, Jesus. Oh, my gosh. Ashanti deserves better than this. What is this all about? Nope, no wedding ring. None, you guys. Red lipstick, I missed you. How are you? The red lipstick, Hustler Lily. It's been so long. You guys, I know I haven't been on my YouTube channel because I've been on my TikTok because I notice a lot of you are not, I don't even know what you guys want to watch anymore on my YouTube channel. Um, I got tired of talking about Jeannie Mai, but I might talk about her again if you want me to, but I just don't know what you guys want me to talk about. So it's just been really fun on TikTok, but I've been, um, yeah, getting in trouble over there. People have been reporting my videos. They're saying I am a fake person. I have fake engagement. <laughs> they think my voice is fake as well. So um, they are reporting me over there. Okay. But be sure to follow me. <laughs> I'm going to try not to give up. Okay. <laughs> It's because I'm not showing up on my TikTok. It's basically my voice. And that's why they are, you know, they're reporting me. So I'm going to have to just show myself mostly on my videos. And I do, I do actually on my TikTok, but I just found it easier if I'm not on my videos because it's easier to talk and to navigate and to do what I want to do. But I'll do better, you guys. Um, yeah, no ring, no nothing, you guys. Just wanting to um, ensure that um, this time around, he has made an impact, a mark in Ashanti's life. That's what he wanted to do. Wow. Angela says, let them know in the beginning. Yeah, always let a man know in the beginning, like, this is, this is what I, my expectations are in my life. And this is what I want in my life. Don't let somebody else try to control what you want in your life and your goals and stuff like that. You need to let them know. And if they're not able to do that, then they're not for you. Okay. 
If you're someone who values family and all that kind of stuff, then that's great. You let them know at the beginning. That's what Angela says. Let them know in the beginning. Yep. Yep. But there's some ladies that are like afraid to say something. Who cares? This is your life. This is your life. And Ashanti, you guys, the reason why it's disappointing is because Ashanti is beautiful. She's talented. She's a great woman. And there's so many men that are successful and millionaires that would love to be with someone like her, I think. So the fact that she had to settle for this kind of treatment from this guy, it's not worth it. She doesn't deserve this. Oh, thank you for the love, red lipstick. I appreciate you. Thanks. Thanks so much. By the way, Gloria says Nelly has kids already. Nothing new for him. But she's grabbing at him this time around before she's too old to have a baby. You're right. But why him, though? Why him? Why him, you guys? Why him? And this is also someone that's known her when she was young. You know, when she was just a young girl in her prime, all this. He knew her then. He comes back into her life 20 years later just to make her a baby mama. Like, why do you keep, why is he misleading her like this? Why is he treating her like this? And she's so pleasant. She's just a delight. Hmm. You guys, by the way, I do like Nelly's music and stuff. I do listen to his music. I do. If you watch my TikTok, you'll see I listen to his music. Um, well, one song. <laughs> the song, um, Never Stop Loving Me, where he sings that song um, to his mom, thanking his mom for always loving him. Um, that song, I think it's called like that, like loving me. Um, so I love that song. So I do listen to that. And plus also he has so many great songs. And I do like him as a person. I think he's a nice guy too. But I just don't like how he's treating Ashanti. I don't appreciate it. I just don't appreciate it. I don't think this is fair. Oh my gosh. Anyway, you guys know I'm sad about this. I should go, right? Like, I, I mean, this is not, this is not going to get better. How I feel about this is not a good feeling. So um, for some of you, you're not going to like to watch this video, okay? Especially since I've seen there's fans, there's women that are like rooting for her. They're like, it, it you know, it just doesn't matter. You know, there's no guarantee that this relationship is going to work out anyway. Um, so, you know, it's just better. At least she has a child. She will have a child that's going to be with her forever. And it's like, okay, so that's, that's it. So it's all about having a child for yourself. So I saw some ladies that were like, well, if he leaves, it doesn't matter because she's going to have a child. That's something that she's going to have a child out of this and she'll be able to have her child in her life. So if he goes, that's his problem because she's going to have a child in her life. And I'm like, wow, I never knew that was something to be really like proud of or something like this. Like if the guy leaves, at least I have a child. Oh my God, at least I have my child, a child that's going to love me and be with me. But is, is that the, really the goal though? Like, isn't the goal also to have a child and have that man in your life and raise your child together as a family? Isn't that the goal? You know, why would the goal be like, well, let me have a child. So if this person leaves me, at least I have my child, you know, so that kind of comes across like as if it's kind of needy and it's kind of like as if you're looking for someone to love you. So it's like kind of like, oh, if that guy's love's gone, at least your child is there to love you. I don't know, but it's just kind of like, but don't you want the man to be part of your life anyway? Like, why think of that man leaving you with your child? It's just to me, it's just, 
I don't subscribe to this, ladies. I don't subscribe to this. Make sure you're liking the video. I know a lot of you don't like this, okay? But it's it's okay. Um, this is just my opinion. My opinion's not the only opinion, okay? Some of the ladies in the comments do agree that Ashanti deserves better than this, okay? We, we think she deserves commitment. She's 43 years old. How do you play around with a 43-year-old woman? 43 years old. I can understand if Nelly was not established and he was in his 20s and say, okay, this guy, you know, he can't really commit to anything yet. He is just a young guy, doesn't know himself and all this kind of stuff. This stuff just happened. Ashanti planned this. A year ago, she told People Magazine that she was ready to have a family, to have children. She wanted marriage in her life. A year ago, this is not a mistake. This was Ashanti's dream and plan. So if Ashanti planned for this and Nelly's back in her life and everything, what was his plans for her? What plans has this man been making for Ashanti? That is the question. Red Lipstick Lily, thank you so much for your kind words. She says, you're doing fantastic, Queen. Thank you for your support, everyone. I really appreciate you, ladies. Welcome to the Midnight Society. New subscribers, I see you guys. Gloria says, I think she always wanted him. I agree. Because when I see the body language, I'm like, yep, absolutely. Absolutely. It's just a guy's energy is so dry at times. And I'm just asking myself, like, can you just leave her alone? Can you just leave this girl alone? Like, if you know you're not serious, please just leave her alone. You know, just leave her alone. You did not have to do this to her. You did not. You guys, I understand these are rich people, okay? So I know Ashanti's baby is going to be just fine and all this. I know that. We all know that. But I'm just saying Ashanti is also a public figure that's lived a certain lifestyle. She's well-respected. A lot of girls really look up to her. And we do want the best for her. We really do. And I'm her fan. And I, I do want to see the best for her. And I want to see Nelly step up and honor her and treat her with respect. And she deserves it. And show her commitment. But to come back 20 years into Ashanti's life, when this girl was just living her life peacefully, minding her own business, he decides to come back after breaking her heart 20 years ago just to make her a baby mama at 43 years old? Yikes. Gloria says, um, oh, yeah, I read that comment. Thanks, Gloria. Yes, Angela, I agree. Angela says, but no real commitment. Nope, nothing. Nothing. Ashanti at 43, I think she was just desperate as well, just for a child, because she was 43 years old. And I think she was just kind of like, oh, who's the best person to have a child with? Oh, okay, Nelly. Yeah, let's go do this. And just kind of that energy. And maybe Nelly did not even want, maybe he doesn't even, like, I don't know. I don't know why. I just feel like it's more her. Because he already has children. And he's in his, isn't he in his late 40s? You guys, how old is Nelly again? Let's find out. Let's find out how old he is. He's 49 years old, almost 50 years old. Ashanti's 43. You know that this was all Ashanti that wanted a child because he already has grown children. What man with grown children? Most of them don't even want to have a child. So I think Nelly was like, oh, okay, I'll do this for you. This is this is actually telling me something like that. Okay, he has grown adult children. He never committed to anything because for him, he's okay with her just being a girlfriend and that's it for them to make music together. I think he also likes the attention that people give them as a couple. 
okay? His failed relationship with his fiance, the mother of his children, he's not serious. We have to look at his history. But Ashanti thought, okay, yeah, I'll be next. He's going to treat her just like he treated the exes. Okay, she's not being treated any different. Gloria says, that's nonsense. A child from someone who doesn't really love you or the child, that's ignorant. And you should take your head out of the sand. Um, I'm trying to understand here. A child from someone who doesn't really love you. Well, for me personally, I don't think he really loves her. Okay. I believe Ashanti loves him. And I think the reason why he got her pregnant was because Ashanti wants to have a child. She talked about this in People magazine. I think that Nellie was okay with just dating her again and keeping her as a girlfriend and being a celebrity couple because they have so many fans that are rooting for them. But I don't think that this man wanted to um, have another family. No, I don't think so. I think he did this for her. This was his gift for her. Like, okay, yeah, yeah, no worries. Yeah, no worries. I'll give you a child. That's what he did. He was probably like, oh, well, I'm not going to marry you, but if you want a child, I'll, I'll give you a child. But why Nelly? Why did she choose him? You guys, this was her choice. This is her choice. Sometimes I think like, is she aware of her brand and the people that, you know, the girls that really look up to her? Mm -hmm. Shanti, we want better for you. You deserve better than this. Like, wow. Anyway, oh, it wasn't gonna be a good video. I honestly try to avoid making these videos because I know if I don't have anything good to say, some of you are just not comfortable with it. So I just did this video just because I wanted to, but I know that it was not going to be a good video because there's nothing that I'm excited about here. Okay. Um, I'm not excited about any of this. Uh, I don't appreciate that this man came back into Ashanti's life 20 years later just to make her baby mama. Okay. This girl's never been married. She never had any children. Okay, never. So the fact that she's never been married, never had any children, never had any issues, okay? She has a very clean reputation. Why can't she also um, be treated the way she wants to be treated? Why can't she be honored? Why can't she be valued and, you know what I mean? And given commitment. Why can't she be given that? when she deserves it, why can't she be given that? So um, for me, it's just, oh my gosh, it's just like, wow. Wow, wow, wow. The man had a plan. He's like, yep, let me come back into your life and let me see what I can do to destroy your life a little bit and cause you some stress. Gloria says women need to learn, yeah, to discern, yeah. If a man is the same as before, what makes you think things will be better? You're adding another individual in the mix. Yep, I agree. Gloria, thank you so much for your words. I appreciate it. Um, you guys, be sure to like and comment and let me know. Share the video as well. Like I said, it's not... I'm not excited about this news, so I don't know what, like, I know some of her fans are so excited for her. I just feel like she just deserves better than this. I know she's 43 years old, but I do believe that Ashanti, what she wrote in People Magazine, well, her interview that she had and what she said is exactly what she wanted. But this man is not ready for a commitment. I believe that he only had a child with her because that's what she wanted, but he does not want that. Okay, so I see this relationship, honestly, 10 years. 10 years. 
I'll even say anywhere between five to 10 years, just to be, you know, five to 10 years, I give it. Five to 10 years. Ashanti is going to try really hard to keep it together, but I think the guy is going to slip up. Okay. He's going to make some mistakes along the way. Gloria, thank you so much for the love. You guys, thank you so much, ladies, for watching and for engaging with me. I missed you guys so much. And thanks for listening to another view as well. Remember, my opinion is not the only opinion. So I do look forward to hearing what you guys have to say as well regarding this topic. I personally am not excited about this at all. Um, it's just... When I saw the video, I was just disappointed, really. Like, really? Why is he doing this? Why is he doing this? Why is he treating her like this? This is not fair to her. She deserves better than this. And I, I wish I wish she knew that. But I feel like now that she's 43 years old um, and she knows Nellie, I don't know. She really loves the guy. and But it's just like, I don't know. It's showing me his true colors, you know, it's showing me his true colors that he doesn't really value her that much. I thought when he came back into her life, I really thought he valued her. And this time around, things were going to be very different. But no, it wasn't. It wasn't any different. Um, Ashanti wants this relationship more than he does. Okay. And it's just tragic, really. Um, everything is just all over the place, <laughs> in my opinion. And um, But Ashanti is somebody with traditional values, you guys, because she's talked about it in her interviews. Um, Nelly, however, I think he's just, he cares more about his assets, his money. There's something that holds him back. But Ashanti has money. She has more money than his ex-wife, sorry, ex-girlfriend that he was with. So why does he have to worry about her taking anything when she has her own stuff? So I, there's no excuse for this behavior. Anyway, be sure to connect with me on TikTok at Sunday Omni, ladies. You can also find me on Facebook, and I'm also on Instagram at Sunday Omni. I can't wait to hear from all of you. I love receiving messages in my DM from all of you as well. So thank you so much for your support. And thank you for listening to another view. Until our next conversation, cheers.